Good morning. It is time to hit some shoulders and arms, and I just can't wait to do it. Before we get going, I'll show you guys what apple we're having today. It's a pink lady apple, so something new. Got that from Costco. Honey, as always. Today we're going to be drinking the Rainbow Sherbert Rain. I got some BCAAs in here. And then something new. I have a Pocardi Sweat. It's a Japanese hydration drink. It has 123 calories, which is really cool because it goes one, two, three. And lastly, we have the Kirby towel back in action. I lost it in the washer, but now I got it back. Uh, let's do a quick prayer and let's get after it. Heavenly Father, thank you so much for this day. Thank you so much for every opportunity that you put before me, Lord God. I pray that I'll make the most out of this opportunity and that I'll be gaining strength through these workouts. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Let's do it. Let's get after it. Might not seem like I'm really zoned in right now, but I'm zoned in already. Oh, good crap. <laughs> We're about to get active. Alrighty guys, so the first thing that we're going to do for shoulders is going to hit a triple superset of um, front, side, and rear lateral raises. One of the best ways to warm up, one of the best ways to really just get that blood flow going. So, let's get going. It's not about the weight. I was out of order, but sorry. Alrighty, this is one of my favorite shirts, so I'm gonna try not to ruin it. So, I might take it off a little preemptively, honestly. Such a fun time already. <sighs> okay, so now we're gonna do overhead strict press seated with some dumbbells. Probably four sets, eight to 12, based off of feel. So let's do it. part about this is getting the weight into your shoulders. Maybe it's just me. The human's just weak. Haven't done this in a long time, so just right here. Cool. 
I don't want to put the magnet by my head, so I'm not gonna have the mic for this set. <sighs> Hopefully it goes good. The movement's still new, so I'm back down and wait. So here we go. I want to make sure it's nice and I'm not having to struggle to get it up. <laughs> Alrighty, the next thing that we're going to do is the uh, Hex bar shrugs. I think hex bar just allows for me to get a better contraption up uh, up in the trap because one, it's in a neutral grip, so I'm not fighting against anything. Two, from the outside, and then three, I don't know. It's just a preference, dude. This isn't science. This is just See how it goes. <laughs> how nasty does this look? Tell me, does this look good at all? facing you guys, you know what I mean? Stare you down. Another cool, hopefully you can see me, but another cool thing about having a towel, such as my little Kirby towel, is that it's multifunctional. I feel like, yeah, okay, it's a 15 pound dumbbell. I'm working on getting my forearm strength up, so I'm gonna hit arms tomorrow. I really hit arms tomorrow. And show you guys exactly how I really work on the guns, but for now, I'm really just trying to get my forearm strength up so I can pull heavier weight without needing straps. I feel like that's something that not a lot of people can do unless you use hook grip. Hook grip really hurts, so. Right here. Up. Oh, it's only 15 pounds. I mean, yeah, okay, it's still heavy, but I'm really just trying to focus on the control of it. Left arm is definitely weaker. Golly. Just remember when you shake your girlfriend's dad's hand or your future wife's dad's hand. He's like, wow, it's a man's hand. Whew. I think there's another way to do it too. I honestly don't remember though. I think you can bicep curl with it. Like that. Good. Mass muster roll. Alrighty guys, so that's pretty much my shoulder day. Today I took it a little bit lighter. It might not seem like it, but I did. I'm gonna definitely add in rings pretty soon and I'll be doing more cable work and the pec deck in future videos. Uh, besides that, you already know the four things. That's gonna be one, pray hard. Make sure that you're praying daily. Um, ask and it shall be given to you. Two, make sure that you're getting a good amount of sleep. I tried, like I said, to get seven. That should be your goal, seven to eight. Uh, we're growing, and if you want to get the most out of everything that you do in the gym, getting a proper recovery is vital. Three, make sure that you're taking in enough protein. Protein is such a key element in getting massive gains in the gym. 
uh, and four. Make sure that you're staying hydrated. Speaking of, I'm gonna crack this open. I didn't wanna open it earlier because I was like, oh, I wanna make a video part of it. That's an underwhelming, but okay. Interesting. Already, Pokari, I don't know how you really say it. I'll have to ask my Japanese friend Kyle how to say that. But it's actually really good. So I might go out and buy some more of these because it has potassium, magnesium, calcium, sodium, and chloride. All good things to me. So I'll make sure to put that workout down below. Make sure that you like, if you liked it, you dislike. Just kidding, don't do that. But subscribe if you think it's worthwhile. What I'm doing is showing you uh, everything that I know. And I'm just trying to learn every single day, trying to grow. So if you want to put some comments as to what you like to do for shoulders, I'll read them and I'll try and implement some new stuff into my workouts. Always open to new ideas. Thank you so much. And I'll see you guys next time.